Night's plane crash on the Outer Banks that killed five people. It happened at the Wright Brothers Memorial in Kitty Hawk. It's where we find Miles Hood right now. And Miles, you just got some brand new information from the NTSB. What are they saying tonight? Yeah, Dan, we know five people were killed in this crash. An investigator with the National Transportation Safety Board tells me the plane went down as it was attempting a second landing. Now, they say the plane crashed in a wooded area, a part of the Wright Brothers Memorial Park. Saturday evening, officials say the flight had taken off from Dare County Regional Airport. Investigators say don't know what led up to the first landing attempt or why it failed, but they say the plane followed the flight pattern to attempt another landing, and that's when it crashed. During the second attempt, the aircraft made a left turn and impacted trees adjacent to the left side of the runway. The impact resulted in a post-crash fire, and the five occupants sustained fatal injuries. Investigators say the preliminary report will come out in about 10 days and the final report will take place sometime between 9 and 12 months from now. Dan? Okay, Miles, do we know anything more about these five people who were killed? Not at the moment, Dan. I did ask about names or ages or anything identifiable about the victims and they said they knew nothing at this time and that the medical examiner was working to identify. Okay, tough few days ahead. Miles, thanks. Uh, by the way, the Wright Memorial Park and that airport will reopen Tuesday morning.